History, culture, religious beliefs, customs, and traditions are passed across generations through language. But what happens when people stop speaking their own language? When a unique language is no longer spoken, an essential part of culture can disappear, like art, music, and beliefs. Language is an important part of a culture's identity. Many histories and stories are spoken before they are written down. The United Nations estimates that every two weeks, a language in the world stops being spoken. This can happen when the last speaker dies or when cultures merge, and over time, one language becomes more dominant. Many of the languages in danger of being lost are spoken by indigenous peoples or people who are historically native to a region. The United Nations, government organizations, and private citizens are working to preserve languages. To create awareness and increase preservation efforts, the United Nations has declared 2022 through 2032 the Indigenous Languages Decade. Technology has become an important tool for preserving languages. Technology allows languages to be recorded and shared with others. For example, in 2019, Emma Stevens, a 16-year-old member of the Eskasoni First Nation living in Nova Scotia, wanted to bring awareness to her native tongue. She recorded a video where she sang the Beatles song, Blackbird, in the Mi'kmaq language. Over one and a half million people listened to her version of the song online. Efforts to preserve languages are proven to be successful. A language that once almost disappeared was Cherokee. This Native American language has been spoken in North America for thousands of years. Today, however, only a few thousand people can speak it. The Cherokee Nation is working to increase the number of people who speak the language by establishing immersion schools, where only Cherokee is taught and spoken. The Cherokee language is now available on a phone app and is offered as a language option in widely used software programs. Efforts to preserve languages are ongoing throughout the world. What languages in your region are being preserved?